I told you I wasn't gonna hurt anyone. But you are really pushing your luck. Dale, get the duffel bag. We're out of here. Oh my god. I thought I'd lost you. Me too. My legs are shaking. Vince, you can't try to fight these people. I know why you did it, but you just can't. I was terrified. I was scared. I wasn't thinking. I know. I just... I don't want to lose you. Believe me, I don't want to lose anyone. Daddy, did they hurt you? Oh, sweetie, I'm fine. <sighs> Two days from now, we'll be in St. Louis, and it'll be like none of this ever <gasps> Guys, we're not going anywhere. Fuck! It's Dante. He'll get us out of here. You got more faith in him than, than I do. Anyway, hello and welcome back to As Dusk Falls. This time I'm trying to play this game with companion app on my this phone. This is Sheriff Romero of the Two Rock County Sheriff's Department. But you assholes know that already. The good news is, in Arizona, burglary is a class 3 felony. You can practically get off with a warning. The bad news is, your dipshit's broke into my house with my goddamn wife home. Jay, check they can't get in the back. You people are smart, you'll save me some trouble and just give yourselves up. Keep the ringer on in there. I'm gonna call you to negotiate your surrender. We're not talking with this asshole. Right? Dante will get us out. He's too strong-minded for his own good half the time. But he gets things done. <laughs> you know, will they negotiate? So will they even negotiate with him? I mean, if they rob their own sheriff, that can't be a good omen. Not sure Dante even knows it's them. Once he finds out, he might not want to negotiate either. Wonder if he knows Ash isn't here tonight. Ash is your son? Yeah. Best thing I ever did. We're sitting ducks here. I say we stick to the plan. Take our chances with a hostage. The back gate's chained up. There's no way in. Tyler, I don't know. Maybe we should just give ourselves- Don't say it. Romero's impatient, and these small town cops couldn't catch a cold. Our best move is to wait. <sighs> is someone gonna get that? The police are gonna catch you and put you in jail. You cut it out or I'll put you in a corner. Hey! You can't talk to my granddaughter like that. She's six years old. She's just speaking her mind. Yeah, I'm speaking my mind. <gasps> Enough! Next person who talks is going in the back office. <sighs> There's a second phone back there. If you could reach Dante without them knowing. Oh. <laughs> uh, calmly? You're not going to put anyone in that office. Believe me, I will. No offense, but I think you're just hot wind. All right, that's it. Into the back. No. Don't separate us. He'll stay quiet. Michelle, it's fine. It's not fine. None of this is fine. I think you both need a little time out. Jay, make sure nobody answers the damn phone. We already know it's empty. I mean, the shotgun. Keep your mouth shut and don't make me come in here again. What was that all about? There's a second phone. If the sheriff calls again. Good thinking. Can you get your hands free? Oh. <coughs> yeah, it's no good. It's too tight. All right. How do we do this? Friction, maybe. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. 
Or we use scissors. Or we use scissors. Think you can knock that pen holder to the floor? That's nope. it. It's gonna fall. Try to cover the noise. I'll cough. On three. One. Two. I doubt that would have worked. I mean the cough. If it's the cops, they're gonna keep calling. Can you reach the scissors? <laughs> I have to admit it's pretty interesting playing this on the phone. Quick! I'll block the door. I'm in the Desert Dream Motel. Can you connect me directly to the sheriff? This is Sheriff Romero. Who am I talking to? My name is Vincent Walker, and I'm... My family, we're hostages in here. Whoa, slow down there, Vince. Now, I can help you. But you gotta relax those nerves first, all right? I may not have much time. I get it. So what can you tell me about what's going on in there? E the motel stuff is here. Oh! And Joyce and Paul are both doing okay. Yeah, well, Joyce is tough. I always told her she could have been a cop if she wanted. Okay, I'll have to wait a couple more Walker seconds. Did. He's at a friend's house, I think. Oh, that's good. What else? You're good. Keep going. Okay, I'll wait a bit. Oh, okay. We'll see how it goes. The people doing this? There's three of them. The manager said they're the, um, the Holt boys? Oh, no shit. <laughs> well, that explains a few things. Yeah? Like what? It's a long story. But tonight's gonna be the end of it. Hey! They've blocked the door! Shit! Vince, this door won't hold. The middle brother, I think his name's Dale. He seems sort of a loose cannon, maybe. Yep, that's Dale. Carver you really have time for back. this whole story. You know we're host held hostage here. Listen, Vince, we're gonna put an end to this thing. Sooner than you think. Just keep your eyes open, okay? Oh, Next time you talk to one of my hostages behind my back, I take him to the window and shoot him. <laughs> Keep your people 30 yards from the motel and don't call us again. <laughs> what did you tell him? Nothing. Nothing. I didn't have time. <sighs> You're lying to me. He's not. They barely said hello. These cops, they might work for the county, but they are loyal to him, and he does not care about any of us. And you do? Leaving you two alone together was a dumb idea. Let go! That hurts! You should never have come to Two Rock. I agree. Really? So, let's see. Twelve years as a flight mechanic. Pretty high up. Then, one day, bam. Bits of engine all over the hangar. Two workers hospitalized, and another in the morgue. All because you left a lug nut loose on a DC-10. No, that wasn't me. It was a faulty compressor disc. The airline was cutting corners. I kept warning them, but... It's still your word against theirs. My advice? Sign the form. Take the money. It's a generous offer. It's a gag order. If I sign that, it's professional suicide. Look, I keep the check. It won't even cover my rent for a year. All I want... Is my job back. Mr. Walker, with all due respect, you'll never work for an airline again regardless. Now, do yourself a favor. Pick up the pen. Uh, 
Uh, that's really not... Well, it is a good idea. Uh -huh. Actually, you can always find another job. I don't know how hard it would be. Where do I sign? You've made the right decision. I hate the guy, though. All you've got to do is wake up and do it for real. I hope there would be... There would appear a third option, like... Uh, stab him with the Shit. pen. Hello? Sorry. You're probably busy packing. I just picked Zoe up from swimming. We'll be home soon. Everything okay? Oh, uh... Yeah, yeah, I just... I just had the strangest dream. I was back in the lawyer's office. But this time I actually signed the... A dream? At this time of day? While I was packing, you know, like... Dreaming... About our, our new life in Missouri. As long as everything's boxed up and in good shape for the landlord. I know this move is a big step and tons of stress, but I've got a really good vibe about it, Vince. We'll be back by seven. I'm just gonna pick up China. <sighs> Zoe! Sorry, gotta go. Sure, okay, but. But I don't like Chinese. <sighs> I can't believe I fell asleep. All right, big man. You got until seven to get this apartment ship shape and ready to go. Good luck. Where do you want to start? Uh, do I have to wash first, or can I make the set wash the dishes and stop wasting so much water? Dish is done. Great. What else can you do? Uh, pack boxes. I guess some dreams never get off the ground. Hmm. I don't even want a thing. How many, how many books it will take us to? Yeah, we're good. We're good. Back What's next? Our stuff for the moving. Uh, fix it. Can you even fix that? Well. Okay. If this is anything like the cold air unit on a flight deck. There should be. Well, this is obviously alien technology. I did that. Yeah. Fuck you too. I like it sweaty. All right, on the home stretch now. And we can try that again. Uh, make dessert. I guess. Might you know well. what? We had chocolate pudding the day we moved in, so why not go out in style? Nope. Be strong, Vince. Step away from the chocolate. Why make chocolate pudding? Daddy! Hi, Pumpkin. How was your last day? Okay, I guess. Mimi gave me her address, but I'm gonna miss her. No, I hear you. It's a big change for everyone. We'll write to her as soon as we get to St. Louis. Okay, gotta help Mommy now. Why don't you run upstairs and get your PJs on? Are you gonna put me to bed tonight? Sure thing, kiddo. <laughs> I know you worked hard today, so I got you your favorite. Mmm, hmm, shrimp. Yeah. By the way, did the moving company call? Um, nope. I tried, okay? <laughs> I tried. Hey, I know I said I was nearly done, but, um... What happened? I tried my best. <laughs> I tried, really. I just didn't realize how much was still left to do. And as for the AC, that shouldn't be our responsibility anyway. That's true. I'm with you. I just know what our landlord's like. You break it, you fix it. I could try I'm sorry, again. Aaron, I meant to. I just couldn't figure it out. Are you feeling okay? 
I'm fine. No, you're not. It's that dream I had about the... You know what, never mind. You remember what you told me when I got laid off from the tax office? Make sure you empty the stationary cupboard on your way out? <laughs> no. You told me that change only hurts when you try to stop it happening. And you were right. If I hadn't gotten laid off, I would never have finished my PhD application or gotten my job at the university. I get it. Focus on the positives. Which is why I made... Pudding! Chocolate pudding! Ta-da! Vincent Walker. <laughs> you know how to twist a lady's arm. Okay. You're off the hook for not doing the chores. I God, I'm starving. Zoe's already eaten, but I haven't had a chance all day. I'll get her ready for bed. Will you get noodled up? <laughs> Come on. Let's get your jammies on. So, how are you feeling about the move tomorrow? Looking forward to it? I dreamed that the movers took my... My star lamp. And I was so scared because I never sleep in the dark. Hey, you know what? I had a bad dream recently about something I can't get off my mind and I wish I could. Was it about the dark? No, but the thing about dreams is maybe sometimes they're trying to tell us something. Like what? It's okay to be scared, really. We all have things that scare us, like the dark, and that's okay. I guess we just learn to live with it until maybe one day we won't be afraid anymore. So when I'm older, I might not even need my star lamp. <laughs> Try to sleep. <laughs> okay. Love you all the way to the moon. Love you too. Ugh, this moving company better show up tomorrow. How hard is it to send a confirmation message? Settled already? <laughs> well done. I'd better go kiss her goodnight before she drops off. Well, there you go. I bet that's them right now. I miss you, sweet little smile, Cupcake. One last drink? Who's Bruce? Probably a colleague. Why did the lights go out? It's a power outage. We get them all the time here. No outage. It's the damn sheriff. Dale, keep a lookout. On it. I need to get the hell out of here. Well, good luck with that. Let's see. Uh, let's... Okay, that's the desk. Hairpin could be useful. Oh, I doubt that. Okay, but maybe the window then. Seriously, I have lock on there. Use. You. Okay, I cannot use the hairpin. Um. Do it. Reality confirmation that you can lock pick a door if you had never done that. Hey. Seriously. I can't believe that actually worked. You see anything? I really hoped we would get out, out there. through the window, but never mind. <sighs> The hostages. Hey, did you hear something? No, this. you didn't. Zoe's up there. She's scared of the dark. Did you close behind you? <laughs> They're coming for you. You know that, right? Shut up, Joyce. I'm serious. Why are you so up in his face all the time? 
Should we run? Take our chances cross country? Just keep quiet, let me think. Zoe, it's me, Pumpkin, it's Daddy. Close the door behind you. Hey, remember what I told you? It's okay to be scared. Let it all out, Pumpkin. Do you think they're gonna try to come in? Warn him. He's a good kid, okay? I'm pretty sure. Any minute now. I don't want to go to jail. Then maybe you'd better hide. Listen, I'm going to get us out of here before, before the lights come back on, okay? With Mommy and Grandpa? Of nope. course. We won't leave them behind. There's no way that's going to work. Take the kid. Take the other kid. He's a decent guy. Come on. You guys all right? It, the, please, speak oh, louder. You found her. Thank God. Where are the Holtz? I think they went out the back. We need to get out of here. Give me your wrists. Uh, are you hurt? No. Are you? Down. Don't shoot. We're hostages. Stay down and don't move. Aye, aye. Where are the perps? Just go. Run. Run. We have to go now. No. Mommy. Michelle. Sanchez is hit. I knew this was a bad idea. Fall back. Fall back. Hold fire. Repeat. Hold your fire. I said 30 fucking yards. You try that again, and every last one of them leaves in a body bag. Why in hell would you run out straight with your back straight? Give them bigger area to oh, shoot. Shit, shot. No. Oh, All right. Okay. Stay she low. Needs an Get her an ambulance. Just like you would do if there was a Fuck! fire. No, we can't. What happened to mommy? Quick, Joyce, don't we have a... A first aid kit? Oh my god, I'll go check. Shh, just look at me. 
Look at me. What happened? We're so she's fine. Honey, she's ready. If she was hit in the kidney. Your mommy needs some space, darling. Help me get her to the couch. That's bad luck. Don't move her now. Dale, go see if you can barricade the second floor. Mm. I know that look. It's bad, isn't it? Don't make me lie. Oh. Why do I mean by that? Yes, you were shot, you're bleeding. Keep like what? I don't want to lie to you. Thank you. A lot of blood. <laughs> oh, God. Vince, help me get the wound exposed. Quick. If the blood went through... That's it. Oh, looks God, like it. Honey. It didn't hit a major organ from what I can tell. Okay. But if she keeps losing blood, it won't matter. Are you a paramedic or something? No. Just spent 324 days in the jungle north of Da Nang. Saw a lot of yep. these. Keep on talking while she bleeds out. God damn it. Mm -hmm. What? I, I couldn't find the first aid kit, but I got some tweezers, some pads. We're gonna take care of you, honey. Not, not Look, it went take in her back the alcohol away. The front. Means the bullet's still in there. Well, we, That's we worse. Gotta get it out then. Or something, don't we? I don't know, man. You dig around too much and they get infections. And my hands shake. If anyone's doing this, it's you. I don't want it in me, Vince. Please, get it out. As you wish. As you wish, honey. Okay. I'll try. You're doing fine, sweetheart. First things first. No! Don't just... Oh. Okay, I've got it. I've got it. Disinfected first. Nice job, Doc. Now, let's get that thing cleaned up and covered. It's too late for that. There's bacteria all inside. inside. Paul's in recovery. <sighs> Two years sober this July. Okay. It, it stings, but it's okay. Keep going. Okay, hand me that shawl. She should be all right for now, but we need to keep the pressure on this wound. No, no, stop. You listen to me. What I want is a helicopter or I start killing hostages. Huh? That's right. And safe passage to Mexico. Mexico? Since when? Since now. Look, you boys are in way over your heads. You couldn't even nail a burglary. Now you want a helicopter. Hey, I did everything like, perfectly, you okay? Do it? I'll look into it. First, I need a show of faith. Let one of the hostages go. I ain't much of one for faith. All right. So let's make it practical. You must be hungry for a hot meal. All right. How about we send you food, you release a hostage, and then I start on that helicopter. Does that work? Pizza. Enough from that shitty joint in town. Franco's. Veggie delight. Give me 20 minutes. Good news, folks. One of you's going home. Her. Definitely her. I <laughs> screwed her enough. Oh, again, that text. Finally got confirmation from the movers. Tomorrow morning. Good to go. Hmm. At least we get one last California sunset. Thirteen years ago, I couldn't wait to leave St. Louis. First person in the family to go to college. <laughs> My mom. I'll never forget that look of pride as she waved me goodbye. But you know what? 
I never realized how proud I'd feel to be going back. I just wish it didn't involve so much stuff. Ugh. Is there anything more stressful than moving? Which you see are old. Trying to get Zoe to go to sleep? Yep, top of the list. <laughs> Anyway, tonight is our last night, and it seems so long since we, you know. Mm. So, how about we make it one to remember? Just don't mention the text message, come on. It really could be anything. Wake Zoe. Hello? Well, thank you. It's been nice working with you, too. Oh, I'm sure you'll all do just fine without me. Good luck to you, too. Bye. Someone from the university. The one you just left an hour ago? What can I say? My colleagues miss me already. Colleagues like Bruce. I try. Vince, have you been looking at my phone? Daddy? <sighs> Zoe. Hey, you should be in bed. I, I couldn't sleep. Even with my star lamp on. It's probably too early. Daddy? Yes, sweetie? We'll always live together, right? You, me, and mommy? Why? Well, she's six years old, right? Just reassure her. Always. Even when we're old and gray and you have to tuck us in at night. <sighs> she's a kid, she needs reassurance, even if it's not real. Trust me, I know something about that. It's not well for you as a kid if so, your parent uh, talk to you about a, their divorce. Hmm? Oh, he's just one of the macroeconomics lecturers. We did some research together on the Ecuador financial crisis. There isn't much else to say. Just let it slide. In which way do you mean that? I think that's the easiest one. Like... You never said anything about him before. I have. Plenty of times, but whenever I try to talk about work, you switch off. I don't switch off. I just don't remember you talking about him. Let's forget about all this. Don't let it ruin our last night. We've got a long few days ahead of us. Drink. You keep you go into the spiral you keep on thinking about it and you get angrier and angrier because you keep thinking about it so stop just Something stop it doesn't add up you've been working late more than usual <sighs> because i because i'm changing schools i need to leave on a high note you know, last week you said that you had to stay in great papers but you came back smelling of of wine and perfume. Look at me. Vince. I know things have been hard. This last year wasn't a great one for us, but nothing happened between me and Bruce. Can you please believe me? Yes. I'm sorry. Maybe I'm stupid. Maybe, Maybe I'm too... Overreacted. It's just... <laughs> Maybe I'm too easy to believe her, but this year. Don't want to lose you too. I know. It's all right. Now come here. Mm. 
Don't wake the kid. Wait, wait. Stop. <sighs> Are you okay? No, it's fine. I'm just, um... I'm just tired. With the move and everything. Yeah. Uh, we better get some sleep. We have a long drive tomorrow. Good night. Night. Get her up. She's gonna have to walk. Vince, don't let them send me out. I want it to be Zoe. You're hurt, honey. You need to get to a hospital. I know I look like this, but I promise I'm not actually dying. I'm not really sure you are, but given Zoe, the circumstances. Look at her, Vince. Please, just get her somewhere. She's safe. doing better than you. And I have a what feeling that the Will Michelle be kid. Okay here? will Hard help say. her if there's I've any... seen it go a lot of different ways i don't care who goes but only one of them <sighs> misha come on coin toss goes to you let's get you to a surgeon who actually went to med school no 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 please i'm all right listen to me you were shot and zoe needs her mom when this is over okay yeah. Okay. Thank you. Zoe. Zoe, come here, love bug. I love you so much. I love you that plus a hundred. Take her out, grab the food, come on back. Hey, look, you dropped this. <laughs> Her name's Owl. Owl, huh? You know they can see in the dark. <laughs> She's tough. She'll make it. Okay, they're coming out. Stay right where you are. We have eyes on two hostages exiting the front of the building. I'm scared, Vince. I don't want to be alone. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. They'll get you to a hospital, throw a bunch of big words at you. And when it's all over, you'll have a badass scar for a souvenir. I guess a scar would be pretty cool. That's far enough. I'm unarmed. I'm Sheriff Romero. And I guess you must be Vince. Where's that stretcher, people? Let's go! What happened? She was shot in the raid. Looks like single entry, no exit wound. Blood pressure 60 over 30. I got oh, the bullet out. Thank you. Steve, radio ahead and activate a trauma team. Vince, I need to ask you something. I'm here. Anything. The other night, when you... When I got that text message and I said it was no big deal, you just trusted me. Don't. Why? Don't ruin it. No, no, not going that way. You said nothing happened, and I believe you. Do you not want me to? Of course I do. I just... Is it really that easy for you? Look, life's hard enough without me making problems that don't need to exist. You're a good man. <laughs> you know that, right? So I've been told. Hey, that's enough talk! I'll see you soon, okay? It's good you got her out. 
She'll be all right now. <laughs> Give him the food and send him back in. I know how hard this must be for you, Vince. But I've got good news. Yeah? We're about to have a man on the inside. Ooh. Hang in there, buddy. We're rooting for you. Now pick him up and don't do anything stupid. Hey, don't forget the napkins. Two-way pager. I'll be in touch soon. Enjoy your pizzas. Yeah, I'm sure no one saw that. Hey, it's the pizza guy. You're late. No tip. Well, what do you know? A cop kept his word. Pizza ain't hard. A helicopter, though. Look, I know you didn't want this, but you got Romero wrapped around your finger. <sighs> I really hope you're right. I spent 10 years saving up for this place. Ash only just started to feel at home. How can we stay here now? We'll give the walls a fresh coat of paint. Replace the glass, you'll see. It'll be good as new. It's not the walls. It's what happened within them. God. Is mommy gone? She's on her way to the hospital. I'll blow her a kiss to get better. Mwah. So, did you meet the sheriff out there? Yeah, you could say that. What's he like? Mm, he's intimidating, mm, I guess. He'll keep us safe. Seems like he's got a handle on things. I think. We'll see. Well, really, no, until the shit hits the frying pan. You yep. want my take? Steer clear. Now, don't share this, but Dante's a cousin of mine, and him being sheriff, ain't no one in the family thought that was a good idea. Oh. What are you doing? I'm counting out cash. Jay, you gonna eat? <sighs> Not hungry. I want it to be over, Tyler. All of it. It'll be over when we win. You remember that? And do your part. You need some goddamn food. Vince, can I count on you? The fastest one. Good. Hey, you want to share that with the rest of us? They took from me a black book. Need you to find um, it. Nope. Don't think I do. What is it? Are you serious? Just search their stuff. Hmm? No, you can't have any. What if I'm caught? Try making friends with them. Hmm? What do you mean we can't have any? There's six pizzas. For us. So back the fuck off. You asshole. Paul has low blood sugar. It's fine. I'll eat from the vending machine. We don't get to eat? Mm. No. I said no. The answer is no. <sighs> hey. How about we just do what we're told, huh? What the hell, man? We're all hungry. Well, they need their strength. We can eat when we're free. When did you start giving two shits about us? I don't. Charming, <laughs> charming, go on. I want to see that. I care about everyone. I'm super nice like that. Yeah, okay, whatever. You're creeping me out. They giving you problems? 
Nah, I got this. Oh, shit, sorry. Idiot. <laughs> Clean it up. Mm. You know what the trouble with you is? You get too fucking involved. If you just stay quiet to begin with, we'd be gone by now. <laughs> Never thought of it like that. What you don't get is, this ain't us. You needed money, but it's not like... Tyler, he builds shit. And Jay's into nature. Me? Yeah, I robbed the liquor store once, but I'm getting a job soon. It's it's not here. Though, why Jessica would date me after this shit, I got no idea. Good thing. This girl, Jessica. You want to tell me about her? No. I don't want to fucking tell you about her. She's none of your goddamn business or anybody else's. In fact, don't ever say her name again. Hey, I was just trying to, you know... What? Be my friend. Go fuck yourself, asshole. Whatever. Enjoy the pizza. I don't think pizza's happening, guys. <sighs> oh, I wasn't hungry anyway. Poor Pearl. I'm sorry for you, Mary. No. It's not there. Don't. You got my helicopter? Yeah, I got it. The FAA's cleared you to cross between Mexicali and El Paso. Now, uh, before I authorize the landing, I want to have a talk. But why you picked my house? Face to face, out front, where there's no deal. What's he playing at? Some kind of trap? Maybe. But right now we need to play his game. How about I go? Yes. I got some things I could say to him. No way. Let him go. I told Ma I'd look after you. It's all right. I put my big boy pants on today. You mess with us? It's the hostages who pay. You'll be fine. You have my word. Pizza boy. You and I are going for a stroll. Hey, tell Dante he better get us out of here. Do you have to hold me so tight? It's not my fault your neck's so fat. I'm coming out! Damn. I can't wait to be on a beach somewhere. Eating tamales, drinking tequila. Hmm, we're not getting third option, are we? We get there. You're almost there. Just keep a cool head. Mm -hmm. Cool head, right. You sound like Tyler. Come on, please make it back. Guess who? Dale Holt. I was expecting your brother. Merry fucking Christmas. Hmm. You know, you were small time before today. That ugly assault a couple summers back. <laughs> so petty theft. Oh, but now look at you. You boys sure have made a name for yourselves. I'll do you one better, jackass. I pissed in your lemonade. Really? Anyway... I believe you have something of mine. Yeah. Your money. Not the money. My black book. Where is it? The fuck are you talking about? Don't play games with me! One step closer and I blow his fucking head off, I swear. Tell me where it is. I told you already. I don't know anything about that. Have it your way. I don't like him. Oh. <laughs> Sniper. Damn it. Take him out. Back 
inside. Go! Go! Holy fucking shit! Jesus Christ! Now He's you have to be good for me. Water tower. We ain't getting that chopper, are we? Son, thank God. It's okay. I'm all right. You had us worried there. What's happening? Seriously? Everyone is okay. Find that book or people will die. You have 30 minutes. Can we intercept those messages somehow to use them against him in the court? Something? <sighs> Maybe ask the kid. Anyway, I try to prevent harm and protect others. Trusting, believes in the good intention of others. Yeah. And fast reflexes, complete quick actions with speed and accuracy. And here we can see. How can I move it? Nope. Mm hmm. It seems I used. I. <laughs> Ooh, ooh. Oh, I got distracted? Oh, by s doing the dishes. The dishes. Okay, I thought it was my thing to do. <sighs> so she did. <laughs> she. I did not forgive her. I was oblivious to what she said. Honestly, if you don't tell me straight in the face, yes, I cheated. I don't understand. I didn't forgive her. No, 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 I didn't. Yeah, that's gonna backfire, isn't it? But that's chapter two of As Dusk Falls. For now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye.